All right, hey, yeah, um, just a nice weekend for the Tigers. You know, we um, anytime you sweep a team in the ACC, it's a big deal. It's not easy to beat a, a team three times in a weekend, and we did that. So um, certainly love the effort, um, all aspects of the game, pitching, defense, hitting, base running. Um, just had a really nice weekend and start, starting to put some things together. Um, you know, Reagan gave us everything she had to start the game, and then Brooke came in and um, – you know, she's just working through it and, and had a, a tough inning there, but got out of that basis loaded jam with only one run being scored, and, and then we came out, out the next inning and blew it open. But uh, loved the way we started the game, you know. Um, big first inning, um, did a little bit of everything, had a suicide squeeze, a home run, a couple of doubles, clutch hitting with two outs. Um, couldn't be more proud of our offense. Um, you know, we do well when we hit the long ball, and Brown hit one, Moore hit one, Garcia hit one. Um, so nice to see the bats come alive this weekend as well. Coach, um, talk about Reagan Spencer. She pitched well Friday night, complete game comeback. Uh, was that a uh, decision to, to let her go as long as she could after pitching Friday night and then make the change, or was your goal to go with her as long as she could go tonight, even if it meant her pitching a complete game? Yeah, you know, Reagan has earned every opportunity she got in our program, and um, it was a tough decision tonight. You know, as coaches, we met and, and went back and forth a couple times on who we thought should start, and, and I think at the end of the discussion, we all – you know, we're pointing in Reagan's direction, and she stepped in. We knew she probably wouldn't go seven tonight after Friday night, um, but she gave us everything she had. And, and the beauty of our pitching staff is um, we got numbers and, and we're confident in all of them, you know. But Reagan gave us everything she had tonight, and then Brooke came in and, and secured the win. This team, uh, a couple of weeks ago, I asked you about the identity of this team. Do you feel like this team now has found its identity? I think so. I think we're starting to click a little bit. You know, played a tough schedule. Um, have dealt with a little adversity, injuries. Um, you know, all of those things that that all teams do at some point in the season. Um, and, and haven't really clicked on all cylinders. You know, and, and I think we're starting to find our groove and play like we're capable of. Friday night we talked about Alex Brown and the reunion with her former team and everything, and for her to cap it off tonight the way she did and the way she played all weekend. Uh, what what do you got to say about that? I mean, this is you know unbelievable what we witnessed this weekend just from her. Yeah, Alex is just such a great teammate, a uh, great player. Um, doesn't talk a whole lot, um, but she plays very loud. You know, she's versatile offensively. Um, we've asked her to play a new position at third base, and uh, you know she's just worked extremely hard over there and starting to get a little bit more comfortable defensively. And I think that's helping her offense as well. But. You know, she can hit home runs, lead off the game with home runs like she did twice this weekend. Um, she can lay down a bunt, uh, hits for average, hits for power. So it's nice to have her and Clark in one, two at the top of our lineup. Um, but I really felt Oda, you know, stepped in this weekend and did an awesome job. One final question for you. Obviously, she was sick over the weekend. Valerie Cagle, do you expect her back in the lineup? Yeah, we night? hope so. You know, she's day-to-day -day with an illness, and we hope to get her back soon. All right. All right. Thank you. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thank you.